China has sent a surveillance ship to Hawaiian waters for the very first time in an unprecedented move, which is being described as a form of retaliation for what Beijing considers the provocative naval exercises that the United States recently conducted in the Yellow Sea. Per Hong Kong's Da Kumbo, the deployment of the United States carrier, USS George Washington, to the Yellow Sea for joint naval exercises, with the Republic of Korea Navy and the Japan Maritime Selfie Defense Force, is an act of provocation. For this reason, the electronic reconnaissance ship had been deployed to Hawaiian waters, and China's largest military naval drill, Kodi Maneuver 5, was launched in an undisclosed location in the Western Pacific with the participation of China's all three major naval fleets. By sending a People's Liberation Army spy ship into Hawaiian waters, China is ready to project its influence to what it perceives as a third island chain. To PLAA, the third island chain usually extends from the Aleutian Islands to Australia, what the Chinese have interpreted to be the strategic rear of the United States military in the Asia-Pacific region, reports the Global Times, a newspaper run by People's Daily. As Professor James R. Holmes wrote in his article, written for The Diplomat, an online current affairs magazine based in Tokyo, the concept of a third island chain does not exist from the perspective of Asia specialists in the United States. However, the location of this island chain, positioned as it is only 2,400 miles from the coast of San Francisco symbolizes, from a Chinese point of view at least, the possibility of expanding Chinese maritime influence to the eastern Pacific. The development is unprecedented, because China has never sent a ship within the United States exclusive economic zone called DEZ, although the United States has emptied the Chinese EEZ on numerous occasions for decades. It is not known whether the ship violated the territorial waters of the United States, which extend to 12 nautical miles under the 1982 UN Convention on the Law of the Sea. The fact that the ship got within 2,400 miles of San Francisco, represents a potential for offensive actions against the United States by the Chinese military. The displacement of Chinese electronic reconnaissance ships is between 500 and 4,000 tons. And they are equipped with a radio receiver, a radar receiver, a signal analyzer and even electronic jamming equipment. The appearance of Chinese electronic reconnaissance ship in Hawaiian waters was posited as proof that China is able to conduct intelligence operations within the territorial waters of the United States, purportedly showing that the largest naval base in the Pacific is no longer safe from a potential Chinese naval attack.